Out again. About to play some Sega games. This is my first experience of this game. It's in VR. Well, if you go a little bit cross-eyed on the text here, it looks a bit like weird 3D, like it's in like a weird pattern. I think it's just my eyes. Anyway. Oh, here we are. I think I need to hold options. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, we've got a games library. We've got audio settings. Room settings. We've got a TV. It looks like a old CRTV. Online multiplayer. That's cool. Nice, cool posters on the wall. We've got Comic Zone. And Sonic the Hedgehog. Everything looks... Uh, I'm on the the um, original PlayStation VR and everything looks really good. I'm not upset about that altered base picture or that Golden Axe poster. Everything looks... and even the Golden Axe underneath it, that's pretty cool. There's a guitar there. You can't play the guitar. Unfortunate. There really needs to be a Guitar Hero game. My mate was saying the other day and then we've got credits. What we're going to look at first is we're going to look at the games library or the audio settings actually. I, seeing as I'm a musician, let's look at the audio settings. Audio settings, let's go to... Alright, now, I want the game volume to be like that, UI volume to be like that, and the ambient volume to be down a bit. So I don't hear those crickets as much. Because those crickets are a bit annoying, actually. I'm going to turn the crickets off. And there's no crickets. I guess you need ambient noise. It, it, it gives you immersion. Like, it makes you feel like you're actually in a room. So I'll have like that on one cent value. <coughs> so that just changes all the sounds of the UIs in the games, I'm guessing. So we'll just keep that half volume, and then game volume will have... At that, so we have all of the volume of the audio and the music as loud as it can possibly be. Alright, I'll accept that. And then I'll go back. Let's look at the games load. Oh, the console settings. Emulator settings. Eject cartridge. Reset console. Alright, so that's how we. So we're gonna go to the games library first, and then we can see all these games here. We've got Alex Kidd. Now. That should be just in the, um, I remember I had a, um, Mega Drive, and, um, the Mega Drive had that game inbuilt in, so, I mean, I should just play that game first, shouldn't I, just because, yeah, oh, there's one game I really want to play, it's these Golden Axe series, the Streets of Rage games are really good, but there's this one game that i got to find, I can't even read what that says. Gotta get in really close. That's not what I'm looking for. Oh, it's this way. Here it is! Gain ground. Now that is the game. The game. <laughs> but yeah, let's um. So you can just go from there and you can just play straight from there. Okay. Just trying to figure this out, so oh, we got extras that one. One two, three. Two hundred fifty games of rock, paper, scissors. Young King Pong. Young King Pong. Um yeah, I'm sure. I'm sure we'll just press play. I guess. No, I just want. I want to see how this actually works. So let's go back. So that's the games library. But if we go to the console settings and then we go to eject cartridge, it's got, we've got nothing in there. So there's nothing to eject. Um, maybe we do have to go from there. That would make sense. Where's the input settings? Player one. So we've just got one player. Because <coughs> I'm not on multiplayer yet. So let's go, Alex Kid. No, it pops the cartridge in. Alright. 
So how do we, um, we don't want it on full screen, we just want, yeah, like that, yeah, that's what we want it. Alright, sweet. It's actually really good. I mean, I need to hold options. And I need, what I need to do is I need to, um, I need to move the chair out of the way and then sit down on the floor so that I'm actually, because it makes you, like, you're sitting on the floor. So... And now, I want to go on my chair! So now it's like I'm on a chair. Yeah, that's that's how you want it. That's how you want it. You want to be on a chair. Alright, uh, there we go. Okay. It's actually very loud. I'm going to um, just adjust the volume just quickly. If I can see how to adjust the volume, you know, like, they got the old VR headset, so... Okay, it's the big button. There we go. So we'll just lower that volume down a bit. I guess that's why I had the volume all of the game all the way up, because these games are very loud, so then I can adjust the volume later. Um, so if I move closer to the screen, it gets better quality, like, you get a better quality look at the, um... Alright, so... Ah, oh, I instantly died. Well, let's just... I was just setting myself up there, so that's not really that fair. So let's go to, um... Um, let's go to... Well, I wonder what the button is that you press. It's probably one of these. Oh, look! You got speed up mode. That's, that's actually really cool. And reverse. So you can reverse things, and you can fast forward. That's actually really, really cool. Reversing and fast forwarding time. Using the D-pad, you can use both the D-pad or the stick. Um, yeah, I don't know how to exit the game. I guess you hold that. Yes. So, and then we can go to... Save load, go back. Then go to console settings, and then reset the console. So that's how you reset the console. So then it holds, it puts us back in there every time. Rookie Town. Let's do this is this is me playing properly now. Alright. So we've got jump and kick and punch. Jump and kick. So jump and then The idea is to collect coins in this game because it's all about m gambling. Fifty pound or whatever that is. Will you bet your life? Oh, yes, I will. Pick paper scissors or rock. All right, here we go. Got him. So that's one money. That's what the game's all about. It's a gambling game. I actually really like this game because it's a cool concept for a game. Uh, should I go again? It gives you 100, so... Oh, yeah, alright. I'm just gonna go the good old trusty rock this time. Got him. See, I'm just... I'm just... Bowler at this game. <laughs> I know exactly what how to play it. Like, I know exactly how the AI works. No, no, I don't have any idea. I just guessed. I was very lucky. But yeah, anyway. over this car. Oh. Respawning enemies. Oh, look at that. I found a secret. I 
I don't think I ever found this back in the uh, old days when I played this game. Because I was only a little kid, like, very young kid. I want to get these pots. Going all out. These ones are um, haunted, haunted pots. Well, let's get back up there. She can get back up that way. Ah, oh, it's not Mario. You can't jump on their heads. Well, I didn't do too bad. You don't lose that much money for dying, so it's not too bad. I, mean, I should probably go on the secret again, but um... just about to go into that door, so, so I had 700. Now that I've lost, I've got 700 still, so you don't lose any any coins for, for dying. These first three doors are for my life, so I don't want to go there again. I killed that car. I can't believe I'm saying I'm killing a car. It's such a weird game where you kill cars. So let's go into this one. Hopefully it's not for your life. Oh, he wants me to bet my life for 500. Yes. Got him. So now, if I go into options, I've got one of these. Let's equip it. get the um, egg roll and we continue on to Paris. Oh. Well, there you go. I think that's all I'm going to play of Alex the Kid because I just wanted to play it because it was just it reminded me of the when I used to have the system back in the day. So now we go to this, and then we go to back, console settings, jet cartridge, now we want this old chestnut, then it's going to go into this, this um, Full screen mode, I just want to go like that. There should be a way to turn off that full screen automation. But yeah, let's press the start button. This is the song. This is the song. That's absolutely awesome. But yeah, anyway, we're going to choose... I always like to go with this guy first. There you go, just got to remember the buttons and stuff. 
We're going to collect this extra soldier and then continue on so that we have um, another dude that we can um, use. So we've got two of them dudes now. And now we've got her, so she's going to come along. She's got like a bomb attack, which I'm going to use against these dudes. She can shoot diagonally as well, which is good. But they can shoot diagonally also. So you got to do this weird like shoot run away thing with her. And then I just cleared the level. The more dudes you pass along through, the better, but in the first level it doesn't really matter. So... We now have an extra dude. Uh, I'm going to use this guy. You have to get that guy first. Oh, I missed! That's not good. We don't want to lose this guy. So we'll wait for him to get closer. Now they're, now they're fleeing. Alright. Interesting. Got him. Alright, I'm just gonna f f get this guy through. So we have an extra soldier, and then I'll use um, this dude. He's got like a weird fire attack. Whoa, that was that was close. Not he's dead. I shouldn't have used him. I'll just use this dude. He's got a bomb attack. I can save that dude with this dude. So I'm not gonna kill all of them. I'm just gonna kill them too, and then we'll save this dude. And then we'll use her to finish the level. Oh, that was close. I can't shoot through there, I gotta use the bombs, that's right. I knew that. Oh, I missed! Like the female heroine's the best. She always she always does the victories in my in my telling of these this game. It's all about being quick in this game. It really is like making your mark quickly. The exit's in a strange spot for this one. But we'll get this guy through. And we've got, um, we lost our good, I oh know he's back, because we got him. Uh, I'm gonna use this dude. And then he can use bombs on these guys. Oh, this guy doesn't have bombs, that's right. He has like, that weird, like, turning attack. We'll, we'll just get this guy to go through. So we got that guy. Now we can use this guy because he's got like a longbow attack, I'm pretty sure, if I remember correctly, yep. I didn't get to use the woman to kill the last dude. Oh, you get that. So there's two ways you can win this game. You can either go through the end with all of your people to get all your soldiers to the exit, or kill all the people. There's the two ways to finish a, a map. No, I might die here. Nope. Yeah, I died. But I can revive it and I can I'm gonna use Yeah, I'm gonna use this guy. I'm gonna use that longbow. I might get shot here. Nope. Saved him. Alright, let's go. 
heroine, the heroine woman. She's gonna be the one. The bombs. Oh, that wasn't good. Two, two more left. Alright. It gets hard now, it gets really tricky. Boomerang guys, they're like pretty hardcore. Got another woman here that we can collect. That longbow, they don't see that coming. And strategic victory here. That was just a hair. Hmm. All right. Oh, there goes my dude. Um, <coughs> here it gets very tricky, like, but when you got this guy, it's quite easy to get these guys in the post. It's good that I was able to save this guy and then just redeem myself with this other dude because this other dude's got a longer shot. Because he's like an archer. Alright, let's go collect this dude. Oh, I can only collect one at a time, I forgot about that. Alright, well, we'll just bust through this. Okay. Look at these guys. Look at these fools. Take them off one by one. Oh! That was so close. Nearly lost, nearly lost my dude. Nah, I lost him now. Well, I'm not I'm not too angry about losing the um the other dude, but I'm angry about losing this guy, so I don't want to lose this guy. So we'll just go here and shoot here. Wait for his boomerang to disappear. Oh no, that's it. No, that's it. Uh, that's where this is where I would start again after a mistake like that. This is where you start again, yeah. Because I've lost my, um, one of my main assets now. I mean, I've got this ninja woman, she's cool. Can shoot like a boomerang that you can control. And now I'm in a position where I can't get the last dude. Just 
freaking hard this bit. Oh, that hit me. That's it. Let's go, this guy. He shoots a rocket launcher. Buzz. Looks very slow though. But, he has a fucking rugger launcher, so, like, you know. You can't go wrong with that. It's all about how fast you move in this game, as you can see. Ah, oh, and I wasn't fast enough there. Oh, I didn't save her! See, that's a mistake that you can easily make in this game. But yeah, da -na 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 -na, that song, man, it's just, it's bowl. It's the bowler song of the, it's bowls. It's bowler. It's not bowls. It's a fucking great song. But, um... Well, didn't defeat the boss with that guy. Oh, come on. This is the guy I'm going to use to defeat him. He can't shoot far enough. Has this explosion? Eh? It's so uh, like it's awesome explosion for the generation. Are you joking me? I don't even want that guy. Ah, uh, yeah, it gets it gets a hard game. Oh, that guy came out of nowhere. But yeah, so... Let's go... Uh, back. Play one more game, well, shall we? Let's have a look. Beyond Oasis. I heard that's a pretty good game. Alien Storm. What's down here? See, I can't actually see all those games down there. Let's have a look. We've got... Virtual Fighter. Oh, these are the um, the CD add-on games. So let's play one of them. Play a CD add-on game, and then we'll call that a um. And we'll call that a um. An episode for this. Okay, let's go do arcade mode. Kira, Pai, La, Wolf, K, Kage. Let's go, Kage. Fight one, ready, go! I thought it was the CD Adam one, but it's not. Let's have a look. Let's see if I can do this. I'm, I'm absolutely awesome at this game, see? Five, two, three, I just want to see 
If I press pause and then I hold this, maybe full screen. I just want to see what it looks like in full screen. Whoa, it looks very pixelated. So that's what I was worried about, that it would look very, um... Yeah, looks very pixelated when you're in that, um, mode. Here it looks quite, um, good, like, on the screen. Because that game's not the game I thought it would be, let's go back. Go back to the game line quickly. We'll look at one more game. And that will be... What is that? That is... Panic. Something, something, panic. Dr. Robotnik's main bean machine. That's what I'm looking for. Uh... Be on the Sonic series games. So let's have a look. These do look a bit blurry <coughs> in this version. Hard to hard to see what I'm looking at properly. So should maybe maybe it's one I have to unlock. Because there is more room on this lower shelf. I'm sure it's in here somewhere. Sonic Spinball. Shinobi. I can't see it anywhere. Hmm. It's a shame that everything's on its side angle like that. So like, because like when you put your head sideways, it lo you lose focus. No, I actually can't see. These games down here, it's virtual fighter, I can see that. I can't see what that says though. It's like, until I get really close. That one doesn't, that one doesn't even have a name on it. Well, it doesn't look like it's here. I was going to finish with it, but I guess it's not here. Um, so... Yeah, it's not here. Oh. Maybe I have to unlock it somehow. Uh, we'll just go to the original Sonic the Hedgehog. We'll play that. Um, I gotta go face the right way. So if, if, I, if I hold this, now I'm too low. So like, just go like this. There we go. That's better. Now I'm like at the perfect height. Right. I'm like the best at this game, man.
I missed the ring. So there's one more zone, and then we'll call it the um, end of the video. Not ideal. Oh, that's not ideal either. And yeah, that is, what's inside the screen? Let's have a look. Nothing. Yeah. <laughs> uh, this is a really cool room though. No, I didn't realize the Sonic's on the uh, carpet. It's cool. Well, they could have done those. They could have made it so that your remote, which is what I'm holding right here, is, the, is one of these remotes. That would have been really cool. That's what I was hoping they did, but, um... Let's get, um, out of this. And yeah. Thanks for, uh, watching. I'll do another episode of this and play some more games. Another day. Until then. Until then. Oh, now I can see much better yeah I can't see Dr. Robotnik's me being machine there there's there's a sonic there's a sonic spinball game space harrier okay so if I click on them it tells me what they are so I can see what this one is Vector man, I can see what this one is. Wonder Boy, Man Stalker, Alex Kidd. This one is Alien Soldier, Alien Storm, Altered Beast, Beyond Oasis, Biohazard Battle, Bonanza Brothers, Columns, Columns Three, Comic Zone, Crackdown. I found it. This game is a classic. This is a, a game I'll just play by myself. I'll just do like the first level. Oh, I thought that was going to be a combo, but it wasn't. It was, it was dumb.
That wasn't too bad. I think it's still my victory. Definitely. Now it's victory. But yeah, really great game. Awesome game. Better in two player when you're versing each other. But um, yeah, great game. See how it amps up the difficulty quite fast. Oh, you got a yeeha. That's not good. I died. Uh, oh well. Yeah. Anyway, thanks for watching.